Good morning. Grace and peace to you from our Lord Jesus Christ, and welcome to worship at Second Presbyterian Church on this Pentecost Sunday when we gather in praise of the Spirit and in gratitude for the gift of the church. Speaking of churches, Second Presbyterian Church is a welcoming community of faith where Jesus Christ transforms lives, and it is our prayer that whether this is your first visit or you are a longtime member, that you experience that welcome and warmth in the life of our church. I invite you to pass the welcome books. Those are on in the inside end of each one of your pews. If you're a guest, we'd love to have a way to reach out and welcome you more fully. You can leave information either in the welcome book or using the QR code on the back of the bulletin. And if you have a prayer request, we would love to have that. There are slips of paper inside the welcome book, and you can leave those in the offering plate later in worship. Our pastor team will be praying for you throughout the week. Following worship, there's a time of fellowship and refreshment in McFarland Hall. That's behind the sanctuary, down either one of the hallways, and there you will find refreshments as well as a time of fellowship and community building. Today is the last day for our children's choirs to meet. They will begin a summer break and resume rehearsals in September. September Summer choir for high school students and adults begins Thursday, June 6th at 7 p.m., Vacation Bible School VBS registration is live on our website through May 31st. VBS is for children ages 4 through 5th grade who are invited to attend a week of music, art, Bible stories, and fun June 24th through 28th. Registration for children as well as any who are able to be volunteers or teachers can be found at secondchurch.org slash VBS. On Wednesday evening at 7 o'clock here in the sanctuary, there will be a memorial service to remember loved ones who have died during the last year. All are invited to that service at 7 o'clock on Wednesday evening, a chance to remember, give thanks, and grieve together. The final art song series uh, concert of the season, Songs of the Stage, will take place May 30th at 7.30 p.m. Again, here in the sanctuary, that's a free concert and dessert reception following in McFarland Hall. Next Sunday, May the 26th, we will have one Sunday morning service, and that service will be, mark your calendars, at 9 o'clock a.m. We'll gather here in the sanctuary at 9 a.m. to be sure that you all can make it to whatever other festivities uh, you will have on your calendar next Sunday. 9 o'clock here in the sanctuary. Two weeks from today, on Sunday, June the 2nd, we will have the chance to celebrate the ministry of Lake Fellow Reverend Rachel Klompmacher as her time in the residency comes to a close. Rachel will be preaching at both services, 8.15 and 10 o'clock, and will hold a reception in her honor following the 10 o'clock worship service. That same day, June 2nd, our second Treasures Thrift Store will have a summer clothing and accessories drop-off from 11 o'clock to 1 o'clock at the atrium doors. Finally, on this Festival Music Sunday and at the close of another program year filled with the beauty of song in and beyond worship, we pause to give thanks. We give thanks for the gifts of all those who lead us in worship each Sunday through their gifts of music and for all of every age who sing, ring, and play. We are grateful. Thanks be to God for the gift of music. Thank you. And now, friends, let us prepare our hearts to listen for the voice of God who now calls us to worship. 